Americana Outdoors is presented to you by Garmin, the power of simple. By Cabela's, it's in your nature. And by Frog Talks, stop the rain. Welcome back to Americana Outdoors. We're in the field with Elite Series Bass Pro, Jeff Crete. He's on his way to a tree stand, sitting up high in an old oak. Meanwhile, on the other side of the ranch, sitting in a stand of his own is Wade Middleton. And some 70 yards away, a nice buck is gorging on acorns. People wonder why deer like acorns so much. I mean, when you look inside this thing, that's just pure yellow meat right there. And that's a great mass for those deer this time of year. When they, they eat all this they can get, they're getting fat for the rut, the does are fattening them, themselves up for the winter, it doesn't get any better than this for deer. Strapping himself in, Jeff is sitting more than 20 feet up. This old oak is overlooking a well-used path near the edge of an open field. You know, they should come up that way. And, you know, there's another big acorn tree over there, so, I mean, it's ought to be, it's ought to be good. They got a big field behind us. I like it. I, mean, I feel like this could be the one. So we get set up this morning, and uh, you know you always think you're going to get one first thing in the morning because I mean that's prime time, but it didn't happen. I, I told I told my cameraman I I just had a feeling that I told him I said man it's going to happen close to nine. I, I just I really feel like they're going to move late, and and that's the deal with the acorns. It's they come when they want to. And Jeff was right. It was close to nine when they started moving. After the early commotion, about the time things started to settle down, Jeff looked down and saw a monster. This is a native Texas buck. Anywhere else, he might have been done for, but the Wendlets are employing a strict management program, and neither this buck nor his traveling companion are old enough to harvest. The Wendlets, they have a, they have a strict idea in their mind what they want, you know, what they want to shoot. But you know, to me, that actually makes it a little bit more fun. You know, they are looking for a certain class deer. They're look, I mean, they want to shoot really mature deer. I mean, when I say mature, I'm talking a five and a half may not be to them what they want to shoot. I won't be honest with you. One of these days, when I grow up a little bit, I'll be able to shoot one like that. But right now, <laughs> those were what we call pickets right there. Although it was tough to watch them go, those two bucks will be able to pass on their genes into the herd for several more years. Coming up, Jeff continues his hunt, and his patience pays off. Visit AmericanaOutdoors.com and register to win. We've got gear from our sponsors, and we're giving it all away. We're also giving away fishing trips and hunts of a lifetime. Check out AmericanaOutdoors.com for all the details and deadlines. <laughs> 